hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding complete display name function in odoo so currently we are with odoo 17 enterprise edition and you can follow the same method in community edition also so what we are going to do in this video is if i navigate to hms application and then to appointment lines and if i hit on new button here i have a many to one field to the appointment main model so if i click on that it's currently listing the patient name if i click on search more i can see we have a reference field in the appointment model so what i need is when i'm listing appointment here i need to get it as a combination of appointment reference then the patient name for example what i can say if i come back to the patients or to the appointments in the notes field right now if i like i like see show like this it has to come reference first then patient name so i need it in a such a format inside square bracket i need to get the reference of appointment followed by the name of patient inside this many to one field so let's see how we can make the that so in order to do that we can define a function with name compute display name inside the appointment model so this is the model appointment here i have to define a compute display name like this is a hospital dot appointment model which is shown here this is a many to one field to hospital dot appointment model so i'll define a compute display name so let me copy a function so inside odoo source code or no need we can just directly write inside here so if i go to appointment.py file what i have to do is i'll define a function here diff compute display name self then i'll iterate self over a for loop for a kin self rec dot display name equal to i'll use f string string then string i'll put here i need let me confirm it compute display name yeah it's fine i'll use double inverted comma here of string then inside square bracket i need to get the value from rec dot reference rec dot reference space what i need to get patient name rec dot patient id dot name what i have done is simply i have added a function called compute display name so once again let me confirm one thing just in case if there is any dependency yeah i have to add the dependency also so i'll copy that to add dependency i'll just keep like this so simply what you have to do is that you have to define a function you have to follow the same name compute display name i trade self over a for loop then i have added a code like this so i'll just print it and show what does it gives value is i'll just print it here so using f string here i'm setting a rec dot reference this will be replaced by the value of reference field then here it will be replaced by name of the patient so let's see what happens after adding this function so i have just already started the service i'll try to upgrade the application so i'll go to the apps menu and from here i'll upgrade on hospital module so the module is getting upgraded so previously when we were clicking on that many to one field we were seeing only the patient name but if i go to the appointment lines now new and here you can see right now it's coming as a combination inside the square bracket i'm getting the appointment reference followed by the patient name so here you can see the values are like for some records if you come back to appointments for some records we don't have the reference value so i'll delete those appointments now everyone has appointment like everyone has a reference now if i come back to appointment lines you will see as follows so if i search for 13 so i can see i'm filtering the correct record which i'm searching like visually user can see that ap0013 test one so what we have done is we have just defined a function 
named compute display name then using that field using that function I'm setting value to the field display name and what is the value I'm setting as a combination of value from reference field and the patient ID name so that's all about the compute display name in Uru similarly if you have more fields you can build your logic and assign the value to display name field so that's all about the compute display name function in Odoo. So I hope this is clear for you. In case if you have any doubts, feedbacks or something related to this topic, let us know directly under the comment section. You can just drop a comment and we will reply you as soon as possible. So that's it for the day. Have a nice day. Thank you.